Hey guys, I'm Crystal Simmer and you're watching Crystal Simmer TV. For all those who don't know me, I make Let's Plays on YouTube, um, gaming videos basically, and on my second channel I upload vlogs and tags and all those sort of cool stuff, um, you know, extra stuff, so if you want to check that out, I will link it down below, my second channel. And, um, however, you have reached my let's play channel where i upload gaming videos and this is university life lp okay so here's the thing i started an lp before university life lp but i started getting really annoyed with how glitchy it was and i don't know i wasn't enjoying it and you know my first priority when um, when filming videos is you have to enjoy the LP you're doing and I didn't enjoy it so I want to redo it and maybe this time I would have more experience with it and know how to do things a bit more better because University Life was created a year ago so that's really bad um, yeah so I wasn't very good at it so we're going to be playing it today and I am super excited, I have to say, I am still going to do two girls, um, one, one rebel, one jock, and I think I'm going to do one nerd boy or something, and they're all going to be brothers and sisters, so that's pretty exciting, I cannot wait, so I'll see you guys after this loading screen, and um, yeah! Hey Bye. guys, welcome back and we have the sims ready. So this is our first sim and um, her name is Selena, what's her name? What? Selena Rogers, I think it was. Yeah, Selena Rogers. Um, she looks pretty cute, I have to say. Uh, she is the nerd of our little groupie. And um, let's just go run through cast together and see what university brings. So we're going to go into hairstyles. Okay. Um, we're going to filter it so, so it becomes much easier. Uh, generations. No. Uni, please. Yes, there we go. University. Oh. There's only one hairstyle? No, there's tons. Okay, there's only one uh, for this, yeah. So there's only one hairstyle for the for um, the girls, the women, uh, the young adult females. So we have this one. Let me show you it. It's like a big, high, it's like a high, uh, it's like high bun basically, and it's super cute. I I would use it. It's like it has a little braid at the back of it. Let me show you it. It's actually pretty cute, but I wouldn't use it as an everyday wear. For me, I don't think it's appropriate for an everyday wear, but um, I think it'll be cute with like, as you can see, I think it'll be cute as an, um, you know, like a nightwear, sleepwear, or something like that. It's kind of cute. It's like a high bun or something, and it has a little braid at the back. I, I don't think you can see it in this color. Let me show you in it. There you go. In the lighter color, you can see it properly. It has a, like a little um, braid at the back running through the braid. I mean, running through the bun, sorry. And it's actually pretty cute. I like it. Um, I've used this a lot, actually. I've used this so many times, but I would never recommend to use it as an everyday wear. I just don't like I just don't feel it, you know? Together, it just. I don't know. It just doesn't get me. So we're gonna go into um, hairstyles, you know, hair with accessories, and we have tons, as you can see. Okay, so the first one we have is like a little pony side thing. It's a pony on the side, and it's really pretty. I don't think I would use it. Me. Personally, I've never used it. I don't know. It just doesn't fit with my Sims. I just never found an opportunity to use it. 
it's um it also has a like a little headband with it as well um there's three different colors i think you can color it with this as well um but i just don't know it, it i never used it before as you can see it's really weird it's really weirdly shaped i think that's the reason for not being able to use it it's kind of it, it kind of makes the feel of being you know immature and childish since they are young adults i just i've never found a proper way to use them i don't know i think with children it might have been a bit more successful than if it's like with young adults i don't know i mean it could have been cute but i don't know i'm just not feeling it um so we have the rebel kind of style i really like this one i think if you're playing with like rebel then that'd be kind of cute just adorable it's like it's kind of um what's the word i don't know it's just sort of edgy i guess you can say it's edgy it's you know difficult i i mean i never used it because i've never used like, like i've never played in universe life that long to actually be a rebel or something um but as you can see this is how it looks like it's kind of cute i really like it i guess i guess some people can pull it off i haven't not yet anyway um but i couldn't so yeah there you go it has little beads as well so that's kind of cute um we also have this high up do thing kind of thing it's like a little puff at the back and it's actually really cute i've used this in my previous um university life lp but you know what happened to it it just started glitching and stuff so i had to delete the lp and you know you know sad stuff <laughs> so this is the hairstyle it's actually kind of cute i love this hairstyle i used it on a sim called cherry and she is she looked absolutely gorgeous in it um yeah so i guess you can use this i think it's absolutely adorable this has to be my favorite university life um hairstyle yet you know like just gorgeous um we also have this thing i don't know it's like a ponytail it's a ponytail from the back i think i'm not sure i think so um, but I've never used it before. I don't think I'll ever use it. I just don't see myself ever using it on any sim. I don't know. I just... It doesn't work for me. As you can see, this is it. Again, it would have been working better with a child or a teenager or something. But as a young adult, I, I don't know. As a sim, young adult, it just doesn't work. And then we have this plant sim. Yes, a plant sim is a new uh, life stage for the f that came with university life. Um, you cannot create a plant sim. You have to meet one, and then um, and then you can be a plant sim. No, you have to, you, you can you can befriend one. Um, as you can see, this is it. You can befriend one, and then I guess you can also make one. Um, if they make a baby, they would have to, you know, plant it. It's a long process. <laughs> we'll we'll look into that, okay? Um, but this is the hairstyle. It's sort of messy, I guess, but it looks better on a plant sim than a normal sim. So if you have a plant sim, it will look gorgeous on them. Um, so I guess that's it from the hairstyles. We can go back now. go back Ooh. um i don't think no um new makeup arrived with it no i don't think so there are no new makeup for them oh that's an ugly thing okay move back okay let's go into the makeup side and stuff like that i'll show you that there are no new makeup absolutely no new makeup none um as you can see only 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 in um into the future brings new makeup no new makeup for university life that sort of sucks i have to say that really sucks because um 
I guess it would have been more cooler to have, you know, makeup for it, but whatever. I guess we don't get it. Um, there are new tattoos. Yes, as you can see, new tattoos. Uh, we have this weird shaped, I don't know, what's it called? It's like a book thing. It's a logo. It's a school logo. And uh, we have two school logos. They look pretty awesome. We have this um, gnome kind of logo. I'm not sure what that's Dad, supposed Dad. to be. But it's like a gnome thing. Um, I really don't know what it is. Could have said Santa, but no. Um, here's a llama. You know, our famous llama. And this is a kind of symbol -y icon logo thing um basically they're all school logos so if you like going to uni you can put them on you know cool stuff like that um i don't see myself ever using them though maybe on a maybe on a male sim more likely um or a rebel or something but in all honesty i don't use that many um thingies what they called tattoos on my sims but they are cute, I have to say. So let's go into cre um, what's it called? Uh, clothing, yeah, clothing. Let's go into everyday clothing. There are tons of clothing, and I find them so useful for me. I have to say, um, the clothing that came with University Life is amazing. I've used them so many times, and I find them the most useful clothing that's ever bought into um, an EP, an expansion pack. I must say, I am in love with the clothing. So useful and there are so many things that you can use on your young sim, uh, young adult sim, and it's just, for male and, uh, and uh, females, just covers every need. Every clothing need. Yeah. <laughs> Yay! Um, these this top. Okay, let's talk about this top first. So it's basically a normal top. It's kind of rolled from the bottom. Um, that is why I don't prefer it. I don't like this little roll up at the end. Um, but I love the top from the top from the top the top from the top. <laughs> and um, I find it very useful if you like if you want to use it, it for mm. sleepwear or something mm. then perfect use perfection so let me show you how it looks like if you would mind getting yes thank you um as you can see it has a little roll up and that's quite frustrating when you're wearing jeans or something um so i wouldn't recommend wearing it as an everyday wear but for sleepwear i think it can work it can work <laughs> these are in different colors yeah that's pretty much it um the next one is a sort of suity kind of thing as you can see uh let me show you this one it's like a sizzle suit i i like this one i think it's like proper and um you know if you want it to if you want to wear it for your, like nerdy sim then that would be perfect I mean, you can use it on any type of sim, in all honesty. Um, I've seen so many rebels wearing this, but I guess you can wear it on any sim. It's pretty cute. I like it. I think um, it's simple and it's quite formal as well. So I don't. I just really like him. I really, really like him. Um, the next thing we have like a little cardigan thing right here. It is absolutely adorable. Um, I like these t-shirts for like the sims. Um, three university life t-shirts because they are so useful you can wear them as an everyday outfit you can wear them at any time it is just gorgeous as you can see it's kind of a schooly outfit this one but I guess it's kind of pretty um, if you're wearing it like formally if you're going to a job interview or something then that looks great I must say um, the next one is this i've used this so many times i must say this one has been the most useful outfit i've ever had like ever in the sims um it is simple it is pretty and i i like how casual it looks like it's not too dressed up and i think that's why i really like it 
Uh -huh. uh, the next one uh -huh. is, I use it personally, I use it for outerwear the most because it's sort of formal and it's dressy, but it's very, very pretty, I guess. Um, it looks like little coats. So and it's really girly. So I guess um, if you wear it for outer co uh, for outerwear, <laughs> outer coat what? Um, outerwear it would look absolutely gorgeous. The next one is used mostly on Rebel Sims, even though I don't understand why. Because I mean, look at that. That looks so jockey, and I don't know. Look. I don't know, it's just really pretty, I guess. I mean, it can be used to wear as a everyday outfit, you know, just chillin', but I don't know if I'll be able, I'll be able, what? I'll be able to use it. The next one is a hoodie. It's very simple. It's, um, I guess I don't like the bottom bits where they go a bit, you know, what's that called? A bit straight if you know what I mean it's like curved I don't know I just don't like that um, they don't they don't fit well this one too it looks a bit more baggy than it should be um, I think they should sort that out before Sims 4 because I don't know I just don't like whatever this is um, but it's great to wear if you like wearing some jeans under it for a sim then perfect uh, the next one I use it most often as an athletic wear because it's, you know, simple, I guess. It is just, I don't know, I just think it's the best athletic wear that there um, ever been released, in all honesty. Just really pretty. Um, the next one, I like this hoodie. I think it's the best hoodie that has been released. Um, it's it's more casual than the others, and it's well fitted, not like the other um out the other hoodies. So I'm really proud about uh, what I'm really proud of this one. I sort of like it. If you don't mind getting dressed into it, there we go. Yeah, it it fits quite well, I guess you can say, because of the bottom bit, but um. I guess I like it. Yeah. The next one is something I am all over about. It is so gorgeous. I absolutely love it. It is um it is extremely girly, I have to say, but I am in love with this outfit. Just in love. This top is my favorite top in The Sims 3. I am in love with this one. It is so cute. Um, the next one is also one of my favorites. It's sort of, it's like a crop top, I have to say, but um, it's also very casual, and it can be worn at any time, and that's what I like about it the most. I think it's so simple, it's casual, and it just fits for most personalities in The Sims 3. Okay, so without rushing into everything, <laughs> um, the next one is also very fit. Um, it is so cute. It can be used as sleepwear, um, and that's what I use it mostly. I think it's so cute, and I think it looks perfect as sleepwear. It's just perfect. I don't know. I'm just, I'm in love. Um, the next one is a top it's a very long top I have to say it's not very short um, but I don't see myself using it in all honesty it's sort of yeah as you can see it's it's just not my style I don't know if my sims will ever be able to wear it but I guess it's another simple top you can wear if you wanna like wear it casually or something but I seriously don't see myself ever using it. Oh, Zart. This is another blank top, but it has um, the Sim, what's it called, university logos on it that we've seen in the tattoos. And yeah, see the gnome. <laughs> the gnome, yay. 
Um, yeah, so I guess if you want to go on to a party that has, um, you know, school spirits in it, then I guess you can wear it. It's, it's sort of cute, I guess. Um, the next one is a normal top, I guess. It's nothing much, you know, amazing. It's just a blank top with a logo on it or a picture or something. It's just another simple outfit, I guess. This is why I like university life. It's, um, it's very simple. I love the outfits just because they're very simple and they can be used for nearly everything. So, that's what I like about most about it. Um, let's go into our bottoms. I don't, I, I believe we have quite enough bottoms from university life. We have quite a lot, in all honesty. In all honesty. All honesty. <laughs> we also have yoga pants. Yoga pants! Woohoo! Um, I've used it so many times, I have to say. Um, yeah, so many times. Just so useful. I love it so much. Um, yeah, I guess it's the first yoga pants we've ever had in The Sims, so... Yay! <laughs> I like it in that color the best though. Mostly because I have, it has a little pattern in here, like, as you can see, like a bubbly pattern. And um, I guess I really like this. Really, really like it. Um, what's it called? I don't know what to call this. It's, um, I don't know what to call it. It's a jogging, a jogging wear? I, I don't even know jogging bottoms I don't even know what they're called but basically it's this it has a little logo on the side as well so again school spirits and it also has a little logo here you know the llama so yay really pretty um, the next one is shorts with a little what's it called leggings that's what well, that's what I call it anyway um, you know it's really cute. I like it. I really like it. I guess. It's not my favorite, but I have to say, it can be quite useful to, to wear it. Um, and then, then comes, oh, I, I, I mean, the next thing is my favorite shorts that come with The Sims. My favorites, I have to say. They are like short shorts, short shorts, yeah. Um, but they're so pretty. I guess they come with like every single top and they make every single outfit looks up look absolutely beautiful. So I'm in love. Um, the next one are, you know, jogging. I, I still don't have a name for it. Jogging shorts. That's what I'm going to call them. Jogging shorts. Um, they're so cute though, I guess. I don't like the pullover, um, at the top. I I don't know, I'm just not used to these, as you can see, I'm not a big fan of this, but, the, uh, but I mean, like, it can be used, I don't want to lie about it, but I think I've never, like, used this, but, you know, I can use it, I can use it, but I just never did. Um, the next one is my absolute, like, one of my favorites, I have to say, um, I love these simply because they're very casual and they can be worn with a very simple top, you know, like a cute um, top and just, you know, some jogging shoes or whatever, a converse and they would look absolutely gorgeous as you can see. I love this because it's casual and for a young, si young, young adult sim, it looks absolutely gorgeous. I don't know about you guys, but that looks gorgeous. Um, then comes another skirt. Woohoo! Um, I am in love with these skirts. I think that we don't have enough of them in the base game. Um, they are just very formal, I guess. This one is a bit more casual than the ones that were released with the base game. I have to say. But, um... I guess this one is a bit formal as well, I guess. I mean, there's not like a big difference between them, I have to say. But I guess this one is a bit shorter, like an inch shorter. 
and um, a bit more casual when you see it it's just a bit more loose yeah, and these are the only um, bottoms for the Sims for females. So the next one is outfits, and apparently there's not many outfits. There's just a couple, and yeah, only a couple of outfits. Uh, these most of them are rebels, like used mostly by rebels. So I don't know what to do with them. <laughs> So the first one is pretty cute, I have to say. Um, it's kind of, I don't know what to call it, in all honesty. It can be used mostly by rebels, I have to say. It is like completely used by rebels, um, as, as you can see. But I love the skirt, I love, 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 love the skirt. Um, if it was made with a different top, then cute, okay? Absolutely cute. I love the skirt, however, just gorgeous. A bit shorter than I expected, but cute. Um, the next one is kind of like a, a dress with a jacket on top. It's pretty cute, I have to say. Um, absolutely adorable. But I just don't know. I don't see myself ever using it. I've used it once before, but I find it that it's white um what's it called it's kind of slim if you know what i mean it's stuck to your body and i don't know mo my mo most of my sims look a bit more mature than they really are um really are um but i don't know i th i think i really like this one but i don't know if i can ever use it i like it though then comes this one this can be used as a sleepwear or an everyday wear depending on how you style it um so it all depends on how you wear it and how you make your sim look like while wearing it um as you can see it looks a bit more sleepy um i guess you can wear it as a sleepwear but if you you know rock on some heels um cool accessories you know long hair pretty hair um, I think that you can rock it either way, you know? Then comes this! Oh my god, this is my favorite outfit out of the Sims 3 University life. I am absolutely in love. Um, I've used it on my previous Sim, Cherry, and she looked absolutely gorgeous in it. I don't know, I just used it and it's casual, it's playful, and if you use it on the right sim, I think you can totally pull it off. Totally. Um, the next one is also used by Rebels. Um, yeah. But I guess if you, like, if you make it look, you know, a bit more nerdy, I guess you can pull it off. I'm not sure, but, um, I don't think I've ever used this one. Yeah, it's it's very casual, I, I can't say casual, it's a bit more formal than usual um, but you know the t-shirt you know getting pulled down and stuff that makes it a bit more casual I'm not sure about the shape though it, it has a weird shape from the bottom here um, but it's cute nevertheless the next one is definitely used by rebels completely used by rebels it is sort of a painting kind of thing um like because the new th um what's it called spray painting on the walls basically yeah so this is how it looks like it's cute but it can only be used on rebel sims and sims that want the avant-garde trait i will explain that in the next bit um yeah so this is how she looks like so the next one is a plant sim Yay! I am absolutely in love with the plant sims. I've never seen one in the game, actually. Um, I guess I'm not that much into exploration. Hmm. Um, but we'll have to look into that later on in the into in 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 the LP. <laughs> As you can see, it's really pretty. I love it. I um. I think it can only be used on plant sims though, but if you are making a machinima or are you or, or you're playing in a challenge or something, this would look gorgeous. I just love it on any sim. Um, it looks so cute. I don't know if 
I just want to use it now, but I can't because I don't have a platinum. This sucks. Okay, let's go into shoes. Yay! <laughs> I am so excited for this LP. Like seriously, I'm so excited. Oh wow, I've mumbled a lot today. You know, I just cannot contain myself. Oh. Okay, I'm going to into shoes. Um, and then we have these. Oh my god. I am in love. We've never had these in The Sims. I'm just like, wow. Finally, I love these. I don't even know what their name is, but I am in love. Totally forgot their names. But it is gorgeous. I absolutely love it. I think with the right... I mean, this will make it look a bit... This These shoes will make the whole outfit look less girly, but with the right socks, the right outfit, it will look beautiful. I don't know, but I've never used it. Not that many times, but I am so going to rock those later on. Like, definitely. These are Tom's. Oh my god. In love. You know, I got the Sims 3 in University Life just for these. In all honesty. I got the Sims 3 University Life for these. They rock. I've seen them in Life Simmers LP and I have to say, rock. These look rocking amazing. So, the next ones are not my favorites. I am not a fine of these um they're a hybrid between 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 boots and what they're called i don't know they're just a hybrid between boots and what are these i don't know i'm just never using them um i guess they can really look cute but the shape is just i don't know i just don't like the shape I don't like these side things. Um, I don't know. It's just badly shaped. But if it was properly shaped, I would totes use it. The next are humongous boots. I don't even know. Oh god, what are these? Wow. Literally humongous boots. I don't even know which sim guru came up with this, but that looks... I don't even know. I have no words. No words. The next one is a plant sim. Oh my god. I am a total fan of these. Oh god. Um, yeah, plant sim shoes. Oh! I'm so excited to go into the game and find some plant sims. Like, that is my first priority. It is so cute. Ah. Yeah, so it's just beautiful. I love it. I love it. Um accessories. Woohoo. More accessories for the Sims. Woo. Yay. So, let's go into accessories. Woohoo. Yay. Oh guys. <laughs> I'm actually breathless. Wow. There are so many content that I'm just dying to show you guys. Okay, so these are like... What are they called? What are they even called? Glasses, yeah, glasses. What? How could I forget that? Um, yeah, glasses, you know, those are like uh, the librarian style glasses. Those actually freak me out. I don't know. I just... I'm not a fan of these. Like, look at that. That's just... I don't even know. I have no words. Then we have some earrings. Woohoo! Uh, more earrings. I am in love with different earrings that come with the same story. I must say. Um, earrings, we don't have enough of them. And, you know, to have university logos on them just makes it a billion times better. You know, just amazing. So, um, the next things are these, like, jewelry thingies you know bracelets ooh no not the face not the face <laughs> as you can see they are really cute I love them they are um you know I don't think we have enough bracelets in the game so it's great to have some bracelets again and um we also have some more bracelets these are a bit more edgier 
um, more rebelly kind of thing, but cute nonetheless. <laughs> Are they on that side now? Oh, okay. <laughs> so as you can see, they're very, very colorful, colorful, colorful. Um, yeah, just lots of bracelets. So these are the content for the Sims um, female university life, and these are these are his tra her traits. Yeah, she's ambitious. She is a bookworm. She is a computer whiz. She is easily impressed, and she's a family orientated. She wants to be a scientific specialist, reach level ten in science skill, reach level eleven in. I mean 10, sorry, level 10, 11, uh, level 10 in any scientific, medical, or business career. Yay. I'll definitely let her do that. Um, she, her favorite color is white, she likes indie music, and she likes spaghetti. And this is her voice. Jackie, do you are Robina? Right. Um, she is also a pieces, I don't even know how to say that, but pieces, yeah. <laughs> Uh, so let's just get her into her normal wear. <laughs> Go back. Let me just get her into, you know, her normal clothing. God, we've been so far. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh, not you. Huh. Hmm. Guys. Woogie doodle. We've been a lot. Okay, we'll just have to do that later <laughs> on. Um, this is Alice. She is also a girl, um, a female. <laughs> um, she is the jock of these people. These people. <laughs> they are all they are all siblings, so just so you know, they're all siblings. Um, she is nerdy. Um, what's her name? Selena is nerdy. Um, what's what's her name again? Oh God, I forget their names. Alice is Alice the jock, busy. as you can see. She's absolutely gorgeous. She's absolutely gorgeous. Woohoo! Um, yeah, she's really cute. Yeah, this is her. This is Alice. Welcome, Alice. <laughs> And um, well, let me show you her personality. She is a charismatic. Oh God, no. Oh. She is charismatic. She is also an, uh, a daredevil. She is flirty. She is a great kisser. And she is irresistible. Um, and she wants to be a blog artist. Yeah. Um. So her out her personality is that she likes pink, she likes dick tunes, and she loves mac and cheese. This is her voice. And her astrological uh, what astrologic astrologic? Oh God, I can't even say it anymore. Um. She's a Virgo. And let's let me show you. Let me go through the. Oh God. Oh no. Let me show you the new, um, what's it called? The new traits that come with university life. So, the new traits that come with the university life are irresistible. And we also have avant garde, which is a new one. Avant garde sims know what's art and what's not, and don't mind letting others know. It's a tough to it's tough to please an avant garde type. Avant garde sims will benefit in the pursuit of a fine, oh god, a fine arts degree from the Sims University. That sounds awesome. Um, another thing that comes with let me see. I don't think there's anything else. I think that's it. Um, yeah, just irresistible and that. Nothing else. Nothing new. Oh no, wait. Uh, is there something rebelly or something? I don't know. Oh, rebellious. Yes, rebellious. Woohoo. 
Um, Rebellious also comes with Universal Life. Rebellious Sims uh, take special pride in pe putting it to the man. Causing trouble and getting out of it is their specialty. Whether they're out after curfew or t letting or telling or telling their boss um, they've had it, they'll no doubt take extra pleasure in it. That sounds incredibly evil. <laughs> So she wants to be a blog artist, yes. Um, so let's go into the next sibling. His name is Zach Rogers. And he is the rebellious sim of our little group. Yeah. I might have to go through um, his, you know, creative sim outfits and stuff like that um, in the next part or maybe in a, a creative sim kind of video or something. I don't know, but I'm I will George. definitely not go through them right now with like the male outfits um, that come with university life, but I'll do it some somewhere in through this LP, you know what I mean? So uh, he is ambitious. He is an avant-garde. And I think I'm going to change one of those. I think I'm going to change evil into rebellious because I forgot about the rebellious one. Um, yeah, he's going to be rebellious because he's a rebel. Where's rebellious? Oh. Rebel. Did we just pass it? Oh, there we go. Rebellious. Yes, and instead of brave, I think oh, that what no. we're going to do is call him a party animal. He will be the party what? animal over here. Woohoo! No, yeah! Ah. <laughs> that always gives me, like, creeps or something. Um, he wants to be a rock star. I don't know, no. Uh, he's going to be street, street credible. Street credible, yeah. He likes the color violet. Um, he likes pop music and pancakes. This is his voice. Epley Condoroy. He is a what's called? He's a sug. I can't even say that. I'm sorry. I just can't. So um, these are our three Sims. I think we're going to leave this part right here. I hope you enjoyed this part. Make sure to like this episode so I know that you want more of University Life. And let's do this right this time. Um, I hope you enjoyed this episode. For all the new people, the, all, all the new crystals, make sure to subscribe. Um, and I'll see you guys in the next part. Goodbye.